I don't know about you guys, but I feel naked when I don't have my hair down. Uh, it's almost like a security blanket. When I don't have it, I, uh, I go with the hoops, the biggest I can find. Is that weird? Hello, everybody. Yes, I'm back. I've added a new product to my hair care routine, and I think it's amazing, so I just had to share it. I, I, I did a makeup video for you guys. I'm not a makeup guru. Uh, there's nothing particularly special or unique about my makeup. It's just what I like, and I want to share it with you. But when it comes to hair, let me tell you, I know a thing or two, okay? It took me a very long time to get the definition in my curls and the length and the fullness that I have today. Um, you're going to see how long it is in this video. Sometimes it's hard to tell when it's curly or braided, but you're going to see just how long my hair is, okay? Let's get started. All right, I am going to start off with the tools and equipment, all right? You're going to need a hair dryer, one with a diffuser because guess what? We got curly hair. You don't need the frizz, dog. Next, a brush or whatever detangling device of your choice. It's totally up to you. Last tool I like to uh, use is the water bottle, spray bottle. Pretty simple. You don't need it, but you know, I think it's a good way to keep moisture in your hair and make sure your hair is retaining the most basic form of moisture, water. Now for the products. The first product I use is Suave Conditioner. Yeah, it's just Suave Professionals. Pretty basic, right? Now, sometimes I wash this out in the shower and sometimes I don't. Please don't come for me, you guys. I like to leave it in. I haven't had any problems with this specific conditioner causing any type of buildup, flakes, or anything of the sort. Otherwise, I wouldn't be doing it, okay? The next product I use is Miel. Oh my God. This is what helped me find my curls. This one in particular is the pomegranate and honey. It is leave-in conditioner. So um, this is what I glob on next after the swabs. Last product that I use is a styling gel. The first styling gel I ever used was actually Miel styling gel. I still like it, but I, I switched to the Cantu um, styling gel. This one, there's two kinds. This one is the olive oil and flaxseed styling gel. There's another one that's I think um, a different sort of oil, oil maybe uh, argan oil. The reason why I switched to Shea Cantu um, I found out that this is, and by accident, right? They didn't have the Miel in stock, so I, I got the Cantu and I crossed my fingers and you know what? It was a good gut choice because what happened was I found that this is my new product. This product, I think, is just as good as Miel when it came to having curl definition, but it, I think it works longer. And it's just as good as Miel, again, in the facet that uh, it doesn't create any flake, it doesn't make your curls look hard, they still look very soft while giving you the perfect curl definition, right? And that's what we all want. All us curly heads, we just want the perfect curl definition. Give it to me. Okay, so this is the first step. I'm applying the Swap Professionals to my hair. I'll typically do it in half or in quarter sections just to make sure that the product is evenly applied to my hair. Step two, I'm going to apply my leave-in conditioner. That's the Miel Pomegranate Honey product. I'll do the same. I'll just apply it either in quarters or in... Um, you know, half sections here, just to make sure I'm getting it all the way through to all of my hair. All right, this is stage three. We all know it very well. It's the detangling stage. I want you to pay attention to how I'm detangling. It's from the bottom up. That has made a very big change in how long my hair has grown. So make sure to start brushing from the bottom detangle from the bottom and then go up towards the, your roots uh, just for optimal detangling experience. Okay, so this is step four. I haven't mentioned it yet, but it's quite important. This is also what's changed uh, in, you know, adding curl definition to my hair. Here I am actually finger curling a group of curls. So I'll take a group of curls, 
uh, into my hand or my finger and I'll twirl it around sometimes it'll take a minute to find you know which way it needs to curl best or what group of hairs curl best together uh, sometimes layers but once you find it it's pretty easy and it will make it dry so nicely it's really important to do this before you start diffusing your hair okay guys all right so stage five i'm applying my styling gel as you can see this is again after you do your finger curls so that the curls already have their shape and you're just kind of coating the top layer and the curls that you've finger curled right because we want to make sure that those curls hold all right so after you've done your finger curls and put on your styling gel we're going to begin diffusing at first you want to stay pretty far away from the curls and just apply some heat i always go to high heat you know um i haven't had too much too many issues in the past with heat onto my hair i don't straighten it often next you're going to want to massage your head with the, the diffuser um, like you see here uh, this is the stage after it's just a little dry, you know, not soaking wet, that you actually start touching the diffuser to your hair and bringing up those curls like we all see in other videos. Hello, everybody. So this is me an hour and a half after diffusing my hair. These are the results. I'm going to try to show you guys as best possible. All right, you see that? Yeah, it's just, it's just very beautiful. It really is. All right, and so I wanna review three things uh, that we went over today. One, I think you should brush your hair from the bottom to the top. It made all the difference for me. I feel like my hair just started growing like wildfire after that. Number two, styling gel. I associated styling gel with a bad buildup of product on the scalp and hard looking curls and problems with detangling, but I've experienced none of which with this product. Number three, last thing is finger curling. So while my hair is wet but not dry yet, I um, <clears throat> I use my finger to curl some of these. Uh, they, they curl like this naturally, you guys but some of them don't all do that and so I just give it a little assistance by twirling it around my finger so those are the three things that I think made all the difference in my hair care routine uh, thank you guys so much for watching please come back and see me again if you don't know I am on a weight loss journey and I'm going to be keeping up with you guys uh, regarding that matter at least once a month um, thanks again so much for watching downtown and I'm okay He's got it all figured out It's what they all say, yeah Everyone's looking at me thinking that I'm different Everyone's looking at me thinking that I'm living But I don't really care what they all say